watched him upset a super duper top player. The first time was at Genesis against Chudad. And Moki was was just a boy. He was yet a boy. I do remember. You remember that. this? Yeah, I do. And I he do. signed Chudad up and then he like popped off and I was like, that was badass. Let's go, Moki. Whoa. And that was his first time beating any top player. So, so this is kind of his so breakout. We already know, we already know that Moki knows his matchups. He knows At least he used to, right? It's, you can forget matchups, you know, like if you haven't played true, in a while. True, true, true. I will say, every time I've passed by Slug in the venue, they've been super serious. No yeah. smile on the, their, their zone. And then it'd be funny. Except right. Making this money is a fun. Yeah. That's right. It's right? a big it's, it's, it's a, a day in the office. Get your money, I'm not your funny yet, you know? <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Ooh, that was nice. That was oh! Nice. Off the up smash, and you're probably dead? Yeah, maybe. So, four smash is going to kill direct. No, it is. Yeah. Wow. It's going to kill off the wall. I oh, had, my I, I God. had people say that it's not that different once you're in the corner. You're pretty much dead anyway. Once you're in the corner, it's a wobble. Yeah. Right. Another one. Yeah, the RNG stays the same then on the ledge that, that, that you have to react yeah, to. Yeah, Nana will always do fourth throw. Mm -hmm. If so, you're in the middle of the stage, it's harder. The one thing about it that 20 Ice Climbers mains all tweeted at me to point out at Shine, so I will point it out for those people, is that um, when you do the handoff, you inch closer and closer to the ledge. So if you're too close, you can't do it for that long. That's the one thing. Oh, so you just have to be just before. Exactly. Mm -hmm. You got to have a little bit of room to work with. Slug is, Slug is going good. off. Slug is Wow! Oh Slug is so God. fucking good. Wow. So fucking good. That's crazy. Um, yeah, no, this is impressive. This you is know what's crazy? Good. Slug played back when wobbling was legal, but Slug was not that good. <laughs> Which right. makes no goddamn sense. <laughs> Slug was held back by wobbling. Held back by unironically. Held back by wobbling. <laughs> keep wobbling, man. Keep, yeah, keep it, man. Slug is a big hero for oh. this character. Oh. Slug tried to stall out with the upbeat and not get Shine Spike and grab the ledge late. Mm. Almost working out. Mm. Yeah, so, okay. okay. Ah, you at least got to kill Nana there. Ooh, Nana, okay. He's coming back. Oh, that's tough. Yeah. Big down smash. All right, that's a gimme game. That's yeah, yeah, you'll gimme. take that, you'll take that. For right. Moki, I think at a certain point it turns into like, okay, you take a couple notes and say to yourself, okay, I'm missing my Nana kills. You know, I'm playing the interactions where I split them up. I'm playing those wrong. Right. Um, and you just, you just got to tighten up. There's certain things you can't give Ices. One of them, you can't give them up air because every Icy is going to try to up air just like that. Right. They're going to try to up air you out of your full jump play style because every Fox wants to jump around the platforms. Icy is going to try to up air you. get clipped by that up air and then you get exactly. grabbed. Exactly. That's it. Stop, right? Should be. Yep. Perfect and positioning. And F smash. Or down smash. Yeah. Yeah. Wrong answer. And yeah. this is kind of like the Amsa thing where there's not really a lot of Ice Climbers players that we usually like, right. practice with. Warm with though. That's, I think that's it, right? Yeah, the Luna so. Dust, maybe Dark Gen X with the second. Yeah, yeah, good point. Right. Oh, wow. Crazy. Okay, really? Love that. It's really rare that you can Yo. get full edge runs with Pomo. If he gets one here and he does, oh, oh my god. Oh, it's like he's just so good. Slug is so good. He's so good. That's crazy. Like he's, he's so precise with the like he uses Yo. the full kit. Okay, there you go. We're cooking with a little something here. He's cooking with the whole spice cabinet. Yeah, he's learning how to. <laughs> oh my goodness! He's just going toe to toe with Fox McCloud no, with he's... one small little guy. <laughs> yeah. Yo, that chase off that. You can. No way, you can re grab oh my there. God. Bro, he tried to catch the edge cats with the up air. Oh my goodness. Wow. Yo, just outplaying. Is, he's just outplaying Moki with, with one ice climber. That's one of the best. I feel like I can't say it's one of the best. That's one of the best combo stocks I've ever seen. Moki's, Moki that, that forfeits the of, game. Yeah. That was three stocks. Just, that was fucked up, is what wow. that was. That Damn. was fucked up. Where's up on the tier list now again? Damn. I don't think so. Damn. Was even technically Damn. on there. <laughs> so I guess you got to go back to Battlefield, but I mean, you need to you need to hit some stuff. You know, you got to yeah. put a little bit of fear in your opponent. Slug looking like the opposite of sluggish right Ooh, now. Wow. That Should be death. Blizzard. I think you can do one for Blizzard. Yeah, and then forward smash or down smash. Oh my. Oh. oh. If you're Man a Loki fan, you needed that bad. You, you needed, needed that you needed bad. Anything. Do you nope. go for Nana there or Popo? That's that's the that's the perennial question. Which one do you go for when they get split up? Either way, I think no matter which one you choose, you got to be decisive about it. Better, yeah, I think yeah, when you have correct. the indecision, then yeah. you get neither. Uh -huh. right. So uh -huh. at least commit one That's way or the other, point. right? You got to really commit. Point. And I think a lot of people have this problem just in life. Damn. Yeah. Oh, damn. You know? <laughs> is, is it one of the things of Kingdom Hearts 1, like indecisiveness or something? Probably. Yeah. Wow. I actually didn't play Kingdom Hearts 1.
Loki's what? scratching their I head. Know, okay, yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. <laughs> and I've got a leapy, no, I get it, I'm sorry. You play Kingdom Hearts 2 though, right? Oh, you just didn't play Kingdom Hearts. I watched a bunch of the cutscenes. I suppose. Indecision. I watched the cutscenes. Let him know, Phil. I played Final Fantasy X. Let him know. Oh, Esfantan. Esfantan. No friends. Honestly? Down 2-0, down stops. But still, guys. 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 It's okay. a big shines here. Just, just learning. Just, just, just get those shines wow. out. Yeah. That's what? tunnel visioning. Sometimes I'll, you ever watch a player play and be like, is this the best player in the world? That's how Slug making me feel right now. Yes. There are times where it feels like Slug, Slug is just so good. good. Right? This is so good. So for those who don't know, Slug it like a double down, Slug just beat Zane. Yeah. Without Straight wobbling. Up. Slug yep. just won a best of five against Zane. No. Knocked him out of the tournament. They're that good. They They're were only stopped by good. Fiction. So they, they, look, mm -hmm. they look like they could have won the whole tournament. Yeah. Like, if when you get past Zane, you know, it, it, you, you get past all the Foxes. Like, look at him versus Smokey. I mean, could Icy's win a major, you know? I mean, um, yeah, because yeah. I think if, if Slug beat uh, Fiction, which I think was very much doable, Slug would have Cody. And Slug's mm -hmm. taken plenty of sets off Cody. Yeah. So, so actually, you like. know what's funny? The tough one for Slug, because we're talking about how everyone's got their really bad matches. Yeah. I think the tough one would be Amsa. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Amsa would be really tough. Yeah. So Slug, and lot. Slug qualifying into the bracket for tomorrow. Shit. Three and one. 16. Three and one. He's lost to Cody, I think. I, I think so, yeah. 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 And, then, and then Moki is now two and two. So still not out. Not out. One more match will dictate whether Moki makes it into tomorrow or not. And I don't know who Moki will be playing. The other two and twoers are Magi, Josh Man, S Fat, okay. and Amsa. Feels like good match. And, and, and Moki's already played Amsa. So those are all pretty good matchups, I think, for Moki, except maybe Laud. I know Moki's not a Peach fan. Right. That's uh, right. It's kind of historically struggled in that matchup. Although it feels like Moki's getting better at it uh, for what it's worth lately. But. Um, yeah, it's it's uh, it's it's gonna be really interesting to see rounds inside because I feel like a lot of these players are very likely to have matches that I think are actually quite good for them. So what I mean by that is like Josh Man, very likely to play, let's say a Fox Dodo against either Moki or Sfat. Josh Man loves Fox Dodo, he's really good at them. Magi, an expert at the Falco Fox matchup. Mm -hmm. That's that's very likely to happen. So it's like I I, I think some of these players, like they could, they could get some really good draws potentially. Right. I think Sfat at two and two right now is very interesting because I think Sfat as a player is very strong across the, the board in terms right. of like matchups. I feel like Sfat no, does a Jack really good job yeah, in terms agree. of the matchup I spread. Right. Like definitely plays the character in a lot of situations. So depending on who Sfat gets, I want to see Sfat in. I want to yeah, see Sfat no, win. Too, I want to yeah, see Sfat make it through. 